Ram Vizhe Kalpana here in this video. We are going to solve a differential equation. So let's get started. Problem solve. x dy minus y dx equals to square root of x square plus y square into dx. Solution. Given differential equation. x dy minus y dx equals to square root of x square plus y square into dx. Okay. Let's consider the given equation as 1. Now, take the term containing differential dx to RHS. We will get x into dy equals to square root of x square plus y square into dx plus y dx. Now you can take dx common from these two terms. You get square root of x squared plus y squared plus y into dx. Then dy by dx equals to y plus square root of x squared plus y squared by x. Okay, so this is all dy by dx equals to some function of x, y, right? So now, let's consider RHS as f of x, y. f of x, y equals to y plus square root of x square plus y square by x. Okay, here we are going to check whether the function is homogeneous or not. Okay. If f of kx, ky equals to f of x, then we can say that the function is homogeneous. Okay. So, f of kx, ky equals to simply replace x by kx and y by ky in this function. Okay. Then you will get ky plus square root of kx whole square plus ky whole square by kx is equals to ky plus square root of you can write this kx whole square as k square x square plus k square y square by kx. Okay. Then this becomes ky plus square root of take k square common from these two terms you'll get k square times x square plus y square by kx is equals to ky plus you can write this as square root of k square into square root of x square plus y square by kx okay you having square root of k square, right? We know that square root of a can be written as a power 1 by 2. Then you can write it as k square power 1 by 2. Also, we know that a power m whole power m equals to a power m into n. Then this becomes k power 2 into 1 by 2, which is equal to k power 2 by 2, which is equal to k power 1, which is equal to k, right? So this becomes ky plus Square root of k square is k into square root of x square plus y square by kx. Okay. So this equals to now take k common from the numerator and get k times y plus square root of x square plus y square by kx. Here k gets cancelled. So this is equals to y plus square root of x square plus y square by 
x, which is a function of x, y. So, therefore, function of kx, ky equals to function of x, y. Therefore, function of kx, ky equals to function of x, y, which is nothing but the function is homogeneous. If the function is homogeneous, then the differential equation containing this function will be called as homogeneous differential equation. Okay? So, we are given homogeneous differential equation. Okay? Now we are going to solve this homogeneous differential equation by taking y equals to vx. Let y equals to vx. Now differentiate it with respect to x on both sides then derivative of y with respect to x equals to derivative of vx with respect to x. You know that uv whole dash equals to u dash v plus v dash u, then dy by dx equals to derivative of v with respect to x into x plus derivative of x with respect to x into v is equals to x into dv by dx plus derivative of x with respect to x is 1. 1 into v is v. So we are having y equals to dx and derivative of y with respect to x equals to v plus x into dv by dx. Right? Now we'll replace dy by dx and y. Okay? So the above equation becomes v plus x into dv by dx. Simply we are replacing dy by dx by this. Okay? Equals to. Now replace y by vx. Then you will get vx plus square root of x square plus vx whole square by x. Then. Okay. This is equals to vx plus square root of x square plus we can write vx whole square as v square x square by x is equals to vx plus square root of take x square common from these two terms under square root and get square root of x square times 1 plus v square by x Again, you can write this as bx plus square root of x square into square root of 1 plus v square. We know that square root of x square is x. Since square root of a can be written as a power 1 by 2, then you can write the square root of x square as x square power 1 by 2. And also we know that a power m whole power n equals to a power m n. Then you can write this as x power 2 into 1 by 2 which is equals to x power 2 by 2, which is equals to x power 1, x. Okay? So, this is equals to vx plus x into square root of 1 plus v square by x. So, now we are having v plus x into dv by dx equals to vx plus x into square root of 1 plus v square by x. So, this equals to, now take x common from the numerator, you will get x times v plus square root of 1 plus v square by x. So, x gets cancelled. Then, x plus dv by dx equals to, now take this y, sorry, take this v to RHS, you will get v plus square root of 1 plus v square minus v. So, here you can cancel plus v and minus v. Then, 
x into dv by dx equals to square root of 1 plus v square. Now this becomes We'll write the functions of v and differential dv on one side and functions of x and differential dx on the other side. Then we get 1 by square root of 1 plus v square into differential dv equals to 1 by x into differential dx. Here the variables are separable so we can uh, perform integration on both sides then integral 1 by 1 plus square root of 1 plus v square into dv equals to integral 1 by x into dx. We know that integral 1 by square root of 1 plus x square into dx equals to log mod x plus square root of 1 plus x square plus integral constant c and integral 1 by x into dx equals to log mod x plus c. Then this becomes log mod b plus square root of 1 plus b square equals to log mod x plus since both the terms are in log so we'll take integral constant as log c then log b plus square root of 1 plus b square equals to we know that log a plus log b equals to log a So, firstly, let's remove more. Okay, this equals to log cx. You know that if log a equals to log b then a equals to b so you can write this as b plus square root of 1 plus b square equals to cx since we have y equals to vx from this we will get y, sorry, v equals to y by x. Now we can replace v. v by y by x. We will get y by x plus square root of 1 plus y by x whole square equals to cx. Then y by x plus square root of 1 plus you can write this y by x whole square as y square by x square equals to cx then y by x plus square root of take the lcm you'll get x square as your lcm in the numerator you'll get x square plus y square equals to cx then y by x plus we can split this as square root of x square plus y square by square root of x square equals to cx. We know that square root of x square equals to x then this becomes y by x plus square root of x square plus y square by x equals to cx. Again take LCM you will get y plus square root of x square plus y square by x equals to cx. Okay. The next step you can take this x to RHS. Then this becomes 
y plus square root of x square plus y square equals to x times cx that is cx square. Therefore, y plus square root of x square plus y square equals to cx square is the general solution. of y. So let's complete the problem. Okay. So we have seen a problem from homogeneous differential equation in this video. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then. Bye bye.